guys my puff is making it hard for my head to rest back really oh well Oof. okay how's everyone doing so it's a nice saturday out here it's pretty hot i hope I can keep cool. I'm trying to head over to the African store. I don't even know what I'm doing. My tire, one of my tires is kind of low. And it's like, I don't know, I have to get it filled up, but I'm just too lazy to get that done because Walmart Auto Center is closed, so. I have to go to a gas station or something where I can do it by myself, which I hate doing. But but I guess I have to do it because there's no one to help me. Two things I hate doing when it comes to cars: I hate filling my gas, and I hate getting my air, my tires filled. Sometimes I would leave my <laughs> my gas to like almost empty. You guys remember the last time where? like i was literally almost out of gas because I, I was just too lazy to go literally why i was just too lazy to step out and i would keep pushing it pushing it until it almost runs out and then i'm like oh time to get gas <laughs> so i'm trying to avoid doing that but it's so hard and in my tires as well i like the air signal comes on and i just don't go do it lazy to step out when i need to step out guys i finally filled my air and that took forever but i did that and then now um i'm actually on my way to the african store it's about 30 minutes drive i just kept wasting time i got me some cookies because i'm hungry i've only had zero today God, it's so hot outside. When I went to do my tire, I was like, geez, why is it so freaking hot? Whoa, why is this guy running so fast? Chaco Red is pretty from the Nifuja. This one too is misbehaving. What is all this? Now, what? Oh. Anyways, it's a four, 30 minutes, about 30, 35 minutes drive, and they close at 7, it's 5.27, I better be fast, because I was just with the time doing the rearing. Yo guys, let me tell you what, I have this story time planned for you guys, I actually would have done it today but i just had to do different things i had to braid someone's hair today it didn't take long but you know it just threw my day off so i couldn't do the story time and now i have to go to the african store but i'll do it soon very interesting story <laughs> of something that happened to me I'm gonna post it real soon, so look out for that, y'all. If you're not subscribed, you better subscribe so that you don't miss the story. I'm gonna have juicy story times as they, you know, come to my memory or as things happen. My face is so. Awesome. I hate summer. I don't know why people like summer to be so hot. I don't like it because. My face is its best during cold weather. It looks so much nicer. Guys, let me tell you something funny. So, as old as I am, whenever I eat Oreos or any cookie with cream, any sort of cookies with cream, I open up the cookies and then I like eat the cream first not because I like it actually because that's not my favorite part my favorite part is the cookie so 
so I take the frame away and then I eat the cookie. I've been doing that since I was a kid and I still do. I don't remember the way to this place. So I have to pull up my map. I go here all the time and it's like no matter what I always need to pull up my map because I'm so used to it. I feel like this generation hmm, nice. This generation our brains them the next generation their brains are going to be bad at locating places because of us because now our brain is not developing our brain is developing to get used to using maps so mm -hmm. well <laughs> Evolution is going to take its place and produce people that can't use their brains to locate places without maps. <laughs> anyway, it's so hot. Still uh -uh. I don't like this weather at all. And it just confuses me how some people be waiting for summer to come. What thing? I don't like I don't know what you guys like this summer. Do you? I don't like summer. I mean obviously I'm from Nigeria and stuff, but I never liked it hot ever. Ain't about that life. I'm gonna go off now because I got to use my map. But I'll be back soon. When I guess the African store I'll come back on because I want to show you guys around. And yeah. I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey y'all. So I'm here and um, it's about 6 o'clock. We're about to go in. Let me show you what it looks like on the outside. So it's that store over there. Yes, it's Africa and, Af and Caribbean imports, whatever. So basically, um, I think it's owned by like a Ghanaian or something but they have like Caribbean stuff and all that so but we're just gonna head in I'm thinking of getting some noodles like Indomie if they have because they don't always have that and I'll probably get some of those and then a few other things so let's head over there I have to wear my mask because we are required to wear masks now. I mean, I would wear one anyway, so. Woo I'm so not used to vlogging outside yet, like in public, but we're gonna get used to it. <laughs> I definitely came for that. I love this so much. What else is this day? Mm. 
we definitely have palm oil. There's one more thing that I'm supposed to be here for after the minute. Yeah, okay, let's see. Oh, all the ones are dying. No, I can't take these. Um, you don't have noodles yet in the main. You don't have it yet. Oh, that's fine. Mm. So, I ended up getting only one item because um, they didn't have noodles and they didn't have other things that I was interested in like plantain chips and stuff like that. And it's like, I think it's because of the virus because usually they have a lot more stuff than they did today, but ouch. But I think the virus is, is affecting the shipment so then I have to go to the hair shop because I need some combs and stuff like that it's so hard to vlog in public oh my gosh I'm trying so hard to get used to it <laughs> okay before I melt in here One thing is that they actually sell food in there as well but I don't buy their food a lot because it's like not Nigerian so it's like I buy it sometimes if I just want that African taste but it doesn't you know it's not that exact Nigerian taste so I don't always buy it because sometimes I'm craving the actual Nigerian taste and I can't get it so I didn't buy any food they usually have like jello fries so I think the ladies is either Ghanaian or Caribbean I can't remember which one or something like that so let's drive over to the hair shop here we come oops the sun eh? you want to blind my eye don't blind my eye please 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 oh jeez what's this guy trying to do hello good thank you how are you you're welcome. Door. Hair dyes. Hmm. See if we have African food. <laughs> it's an Asian owned store. They have weaves and stuff. They have weaves, wigs. Sort of nice, but yes, I need to get one of these. Because at my Walmart, they literally only have this one, the plain one. But in Nigeria, they used to have all these types, all the fancy ones. So I need one of those because they're usually nicer than the plain one. Okay, you people, they say you should come and boost your bum bum, boost your butt, <laughs> boost your butt. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay. Oh, these wax bottles. These are usually really good actually. This wax is really good for hair. How much are these? I don't even know. It doesn't say the price. Okay, $3.90. Let me see which one I want. Tea tree oil, castor oil. I can't decide.
Okay, this is what I came for for you. Oh my gosh, guys, do you remember this comb? We used to have these a lot back then. So cute. Mm. Um, do you know where the yucky wigs are? Like you guys do yucky straight hair type? Um I feel like the ones that are long, they mm -hmm. don't say yucky and mm -hmm. they're less yucky. Oh yeah. But there's still like some that are, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, I'll just look around and yes, see if there's any. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Nice. Oh yeah, so pretty. This one. This one. Hmm, they're not the exact texture I was looking at. No. Mm -mm. But it's okay, like, I'm not really in a rush. Talking about the softer kind or hmm? the softer yaki? Yeah, I'm looking for something that looks more, um, I guess I would say maybe um, bouncy or like that looks more natural basically yeah yeah, yeah. so because this looks just like straight but i want something that looks straight but also like you know has you a little texture, texture and to look at, make exactly. it look exactly yes because mm -hmm. i was looking at some online and i was like who knows i could find one here as well so yeah that's why i was looking around hmm well take your time if you need me just let me know all right thank you yes ma'am mm -hmm. oh, so Ooh. From here to here, these are all $17.99. Ah. These are all $19.99. And then these are $12.99. Those are good deals. Mm hmm. Alright, thanks for showing me. Uh -huh. This is $19.99. Oh my gosh, they have this. I've only seen this in Nigeria and I was literally looking online. Okay, no, not the shampoo. I want the moisturizer. This is so good, guys. It's so, so good. This thing works for my hair so well. Like, so, so well. So, okay. Thanks. Hey, guys. So um, I ended up getting a few stuff from over there. Uh, let's see. This one I told you guys about, like, I was saying that, oh shoot, did I get the wrong thing? I think I got the wrong thing. Oh my gosh, I have to go back. This wasn't what I wanted, but it's the same product, I think, like the same brand. Nah, this ain't what I wanted. Let me go back real quick. Thank God I checked it now. I'm just gonna go back and replace that one. Let me do that real quick. So, I went to change the um, stuff. So basically, it's this one. And if you go look at one of my um, older videos of um, like hair products that I love the most, this was part of them. And like, I only found this in Nigeria. I never found this in um, here. But now I found it, and I'm so excited because. This is so good for my hair. It smells awesome. Wow, they changed. Did it? Oh my gosh. I'm feeling so nostalgic. Oh my gosh. I thought they changed the color, but they didn't. I'm feeling so nostalgic. This was the last one there. So that was why I mixed it for the other one because they look very similar. But that one is more of a detangler and this is more of a moisturizer. And I love this one so much. Then I got my comb and then what else? Yeah, I was saying that I got beeswax. Um, beeswax I is really beeswax is really good for hair because um it basically really seals your end. It's like so um 
it's like so thick you know like that and so it's very good for your ends yes i love it so it's really good for your ends it's kind of like shea butter it kind of does the same thing i use shea butter for but i just wanted something thicker so that's why i got this it's really good and then that okay time to go back let's head back y'all let's go let's go oh my gosh guys i'm so tired i just got back it's like i don't know what time it is but probably like eight o'clock i'm so sleepy tired everything but i just gotta get out <laughs> okay guys <laughs> 